What's up, love? You had a hard day? It was for tea. Is that all you're worried about? Tea? I've been running around after that child since the early hours of this morning. He finally puts his head on his pillow and all you care about is food. I only asked, love. There's no need to have a go at me. Listen. Why don't you relax? And I'll make tea. I might have had a hard day, but am I complaining? Well, actually, that'll be a real help. I'll help you with the potatoes if you like. No, no, I'm a man of my word. If I say I'm going to cook, then I'll do all of it. You just put your feet up, love. As I was saying, Damien's just not behaving like kids his own age. He's not settling down at all. I bought him a jigsaw so that he would sit still. But he gets bored really quickly. I find that no sooner have I turned my back that he's throwing his toys all over the living room. That's nothing to be worried about. He's got my genes, that lad. Just means he's very intelligent. He's got a lot of energy. He just wants to do a lot of things at the same time, that's all. Oh, I don't know, Patrick. I've always tried to teach him how to behave, but ever since he turned two, he's become more and more of a handful. It's the same every day. I'm just exhausted. You're making it sound like there's something wrong with being energetic. Look at me. Long day of work. I come home. I make the tea. Do the dishes. I lend you in here. Don't see complaining about that. Oh, you might think it's funny. But you don't have to deal with his screaming. Say, at the supermarket when I don't buy him the things he wants. People stand around staring as if I've done something wrong. It's so embarrassing. I feel as if I've got no choice but to give in just so that I can get him into the car quietly. Think he's lonely? He maybe he needs a brother or sister. I don't think I could cope with two like him. Oh, I'm serious. I'm really worried about him. I think there's something wrong. I babysat our Sheila's kids and they're not like Damien is. This isn't normal behaviour, I'm telling you. Yes, you really are concerned about Damien. Why don't you go and speak to a health advisor at the clinic? This is just the kind of thing they can help with. 